Welcome to Studio Chatter. It's winter inversion time. Who's ready for <laughs> spring? Are you ready for Me. spring? You guys, I had a horrible last month. I am ready you for some good had. weather. Guys, I did. But maybe it's good that it's yucky that it's weather, winter because you were in the house. For I was weeks. in the house. I was in my love sack for seriously like four weeks. What I feel did, like. What did you have going on? So coming into Christmas time, I was doing great. And then around the 19th, I got a bad tooth. You did tell us about that. that <laughs> how to get my tooth yes. pulled. Okay, that took about 10 days to get better. Just feeling great. And then all of a sudden I started with like a sore throat. Couldn't mm -hmm. figure it out. Lost my voice. Feeling like razor blade strep throat. So start on antibiotic. Feeling okay. Got a headache. They decided to uh, test me for COVID. Got COVID. They, I, and I've been vaccinated. So it was just like kind of threw me. But it's kind of been the weird trend though. Like yeah. I've heard that more often than not, there's been a lot of folks that have contracted COVID again, even though they've been vaccinated, but have said that it hasn't been as bad. Yeah, how was yours? Well, I don't know if I really ever got COVID before, like in February before COVID hit two mm -hmm. years ago, I was really, really sick. And looking back, it probably was COVID. Mm -hmm. And I was down for a week, so I understand. Mm. This time around, it was really weird. Like I had a headache one day, couldn't get rid of it, then nothing. Then all of a sudden I lost my voice, that sore throat for like 10 days. Mm. And then like I kind of got stuffy a little bit after that, after COVID was probably so out of my system. So did you system. have strep and COVID kind of at the same time or were you done with strep? No, or do you really know? like they tested me for strep and put me on an antibiotic and then tested me for COVID and I didn't get the results back for mm -hmm. COVID for five days. It took so, them that long? Yes, really? that long, yes. So in that meanwhile, thank goodness I felt awful because I was kind of at home. But well, no wonder it's spreading like mad if you're not getting your results. Exactly, for four or that's five what days. was so frustrating to me. So I'm super curious about that also because I've heard other people that have been tested. Mm -hmm. Were you tested? So when you had your strep test mm -hmm. and they did a COVID test, mm -hmm. I, did they swab? It was a spit test. And so they did a saliva test. Yes. Okay. And then when you got the results, I mean, was it like the line test? I've seen a couple of different. Mine just came as an email and it okay. just said you tested so positive for actual, the COVID. Okay. And, yeah. Antigen. Mm -hmm. I mean, it's so, it's super interesting because you're seeing like some of the lineup places. I'm seeing like pictures of people with like almost looks like a pregnancy test with the lines. I mean, it's kind, yeah. it's kind it's of crazy. crazy. Yeah. Okay, but let's talk about something Let's positive. talk about something and fun. And in the midst of that, yes. you also had a birthday. Yes, you did. Oh, yes, I did. Yeah, <laughs> it was like great. I mean, I had so much love. So many but people. You, you guys were, were so kind. I was COVID. home and I was sick, guys. Mm. But So not your best birthday Not the ever, best birthday. But you felt loved. I felt a lot of love from a lot of people. So that was great. My girls took me out. Um, to brunch last Saturday when I finally felt well and oh, we good. got a oh, pedicure good. and mm. we're doing a Sunday dinner and I went out last night with my sister so it oh, was good. nice. Oh, and you good. sweet people spoiled me rotten with some favorites so I now have Velvet Teddy MAC lip gloss, lipstick I guess and then you gave me Perk like a calmer drink. Yes, to help, uh -huh. help you sleep. Yes and then what was the third thing? The oh, egg. Oh, the, the egg thing. Yes. Okay, uh -huh. and me and Bo just bought stuff to try that out, so we're okay. going to give it a shot. Okay, I yeah. hope you like it. That was yeah. all at our favorite things party, yep. so we thought yeah. let's let's give you. You have some to of those. do the pickles in it also at some point. You have to put the you have to put the shredded cheese in it. Are you a pickle person? In in the egg? Well, not in the okay. egg, but in the little like the yes. little maker. Uh -huh. Are you a pickle person? Yes. Okay, so shredded cheese and then pickles and then more like shredded cheese. Like sliced pickles? Just like hamburger dills. Uh -huh. Like just wow, okay. it, it's kind of like it's kind of a, a keto thing like so if you just want it like oh. pickle shredded cheese and what and just more shredded cheese okay so, it's so just, and the cheese doesn't stick to the little griddle mm -mm. thing no I mean you can spray it with a little yeah, bit of olive it, spray if you want to also just so it doesn't wow, stick non stick spray but that. it's like that it's, sounds a, it's a it's a yummy super good but little just treat. so random yeah it is random I will. I, wow. I'm weird it's weird and random but no it's, I think that that's great yeah it's a good little treat so it's like fried pickles anyway yeah well politically the legislature legislative session is going on up at the Capitol. Mm -hmm. You got to so, go today? Yeah, we oh. went up the mayor and council and then um, 19 of our 63 wow. youth city council went Holy and their advisors. Cow. And then we saw um, Lieutenant Governor Deidre Henderson up That's there so and wow. Senator Mike McKell and 
Representative Jeff Burton. So it was just fun. It was fun to have the city council and even Councilman Euler had never been at Up the there. Capitol. And I hadn't until I was elected. That's so, so cool. So it's, it's just something we do every year and, and we just talk about what's going on for the next 45 days. So if you guys ever have any concerns, you can just hop online, look at the bills and email or reach out to your local Who? representatives. Okay. Like Who Jeff was Burton, Mike McHale, okay. um, Stephen White. Okay. Those guys Those are, are our representatives, and so if you have a problem, you just say, hey, listen to me. This is, this is something that's concerning yeah. me. Yeah. I know. They I think that COVID has been a big thing. Were they talking about that up Yesterday there? Yesterday, they were talking about the mask mandates, were especially they? that's going on Because it's kind of different all over the place, it right? It really is. Were there restrictions there today? Were, um, well, Aaron Mendenhall, Mayor Mendenhall in Salt Lake, does have restrictions on, on Salt Lake County. I think the whole county right now, Salt Lake City. Yeah. But then the governor said, not in, in my the house, not in a state owned building. So we didn't have to wear. Hmm. So interesting. It's like its own place it's inside so a place. <laughs> I know it's always a learning curve yeah. for me of just the different ways this all works. Very interesting. So, yeah. yeah. Well, what a fun day for you. It yeah, that's really day. exciting fun. and fun. I went up there, I was able to attend a little event with you up there, and it was just so neat. I mean, I love politics, so I love that feel in yeah. the air and the hustle and bustle and all that's you going do. on. Yeah, I really One do. day, Angie, I you're know. gonna do I need to run, I need to do. Yeah. Well, January and February also bring a couple of other holidays. So we just had Martin Luther King Day, and then we'll have President's Day. Um, so I know those are kind of the only two long weekends that- And Valentine's. Um, yes. That, but not a, no, that's not really political. You don't get it off. Oh, that is, <laughs> gotcha. <laughs> but it is a fun day. Yeah, so. <laughs> we can so, take the day off if right. we like. Yeah, well, well, it's my anniversary, so yeah, True. I'm certainly going to do oh, something yeah. fun. Um, but no, the kids and I actually, um, hubby was traveling, so the kids and I took advantage, and we took the long weekend, and we made a quick trip to Mesquite to see Grandma and Grandpa okay. also. Oh, so, so fun. Got a little bit of warm weather, just, I mean, talking about the inversion, but yeah. it wasn't super warm there either. But really? it, was, it was still a still But at least it's not home. Sometimes that's yeah. all yeah. that matters. Just, just, just ran away, away for yeah. a minute, and, but there were there were a lot of teams down there playing. Um, we're right, oh. we're right into the hustle and bustle, it seems, of all Spring of the ball. early, yep, yeah. all of the early competitions, because we'll be right into that well, too. We're so. flying out Sunday to warm weather. Yay! Oh. We're going to Disney World, and I've Yay. never been. I know. Have you been? I've been. I have will you with been? the drill mm -hmm. team. So you guys all have been. Yeah. Okay. And it, it is fun. It's fun. It's mm -hmm. spaced out, but I think it's just really We're fun. We're doing a different park yes. every day. That's Take great. Take your nice, great walking shoes. Oh, I, I've been <laughs> upping my game on the treadmill and uh, yeah. It, the drill girls, their favorite was a water park there. So I don't know if you guys have planned to go to the water park. At but what, at what at, in Disney World, like there's a water park oh, okay. area. But anyway, they love that. It's only going to be in the remember. 60s. I mean, that sounds warm, right? Sounds that warmer. Warm for us. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. You'll, you'll have fun you'll have the bus. I'll be more <laughs> back. Okay. Next on Studio Chatter, are you ready for a good soak? Stay with us to find out more.